All right, no rain in Hubbard is welcome. Storms on consecutive days just hung over the city. Now, most of the water has receded, but it left behind plenty of marks with damage, flooding, and power outages. Today, I talked to some people dealing with it. Christmas lights are always hanging off a tree in the yard of Larry Drips. There's no carols being sung around this tree, though. Just sounds of a chainsaw cutting two branches which fell off during the storm. One on Monday fell one way, and another branch fell yesterday in the opposite direction, both missing his house. Yes, I know, two in, in successive days. And both in the, like, at that time, between, I guess, two and four. Tree branches were down all across the city. Many people had already cut and stacked them to be picked up at their curb. St. Patrick Church had damage in its basement. A backup had put a liquid over the floor, and some dirt remained after the water ran away. Tiso Thomas had a long night with no power and no air conditioning. Today, he was in the yard to pick up all the items which had fallen or been washed into his yard. Uh, cleaning has been fun, you know. Your off day, you get to clean. Um, you know, just clean, cleaning up debris, just ma making sure the yard, yard is clean. But there's another storm to come, so you pretty much are trying to prepare for the next storm. Two straight days had been enough for all of the residents. Cleanup was not how they envisioned starting the summer. It had been real busy. Most of it was service related, but police had noticed some traffic issues during the storm. The lights were out, you know, people, they got to remember to stop. When they come to a four-way stop and the lights are out, all four vehicles have to stop. So uh, just please remember that for everybody's safety. That's a good tip for all of us there. Radar estimates, by the way, where Hubbard got between two to three inches of rain. Hi, everyone. I'm Lindsay Watson. Thanks for watching the WKBN 27 First News YouTube channel. If you want more video news, subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the WKBN 27 First News app for breaking news alerts.